In this tutorial, I will be showing you how to insert the cantilever into the cantilever holder in preparation for imaging in the MPF 3D AFM. Inserting the cantilever into its holder is a critical part of the calibration process in AFM imaging. Before we get into the process, let us take a cursory look at the anatomy of the cantilever. At first glance, the image you see in this picture is the substrate. You will need to zoom in really close to see the cantilever at the tip of the substrate. The probe is a needle-like structure at the end of the cantilever with a sharp tip. There are different types of cantilevers used for imaging in the ASM. Selecting a cantilever will depend on the nature of your experiment. For example, in the lens group, most of our cantilevers are the silicon cantilever, such as Olympus AC160 and AC240. These types of the cantilever are suitable when imaging in the AC mode and in the air. The AC160TS and AC240TS cantilevers used in this tutorial have the following properties. After covering these basics, we can now proceed with the insertion of the cantilever into its holder. Loosen the tongue clamp screw with a screwdriver. Using tweezers, select a new cantilever. Ensure that the selected cantilever is in the correct orientation that is the tip side faces up. For instance, let's take a look at this two possible orientation. Image A shows a flip cantilever, while B is a correctly placed one. Zooming in at the tip of the substrate A, you will notice that the edge's color is lighter than the main body while such dissimilarity in color is absent in B to explain these observations. Let us take a look at the substrate from the side view. Notice that the substrate has bevel edge at the bottom. So the gray color at the edge of image A is due to looking at the bevel edge of the substrate. In B, however, you are looking at the substrate's top. Using tweezers slide the new cantilever, tip side up, beneath the spring clip. You can use a magnifying glass, verify that the tip is well seated and aligned in the pocket. Carefully slide the substrate under the clip and tighten the screw. It is advisable not to push chip substrate all the way back in the pocket as this can cause the substrate to lift off the floor of pocket, compromising the deflection signal. Tighten the screw in the center of the stainless steel tongue assembly. Position cantilevers so that they are centered, more or less, in the trapezoidal shaped quartz optical window as shown. Now load the cantilever holder into the MPF 3D head as shown. It is advisable to replace the cantilever after every usage. Using old cantilevers might compromise your data, leading to noisy images. Also, ensure to store the cantilever at room temperature for optimal performance. In the next tutorial, I will be talking about the MPF 3D head. Thank you.